You are very welcome to Safubafo's free poultry farm consultation. How much is it going to cost me to raise 1,000 layers or 1,000 broilers? It is very simple question, but I cannot give you simple answer. I get a lot of these questions in my email box. If I give you a certain amount of money or predict a certain amount of money that this is what is going to cost you to raise 1,000 layers or 1,000 broilers, it might lead you to financial bankruptcy or financial deadly accident on a motorway and I don't want that to happen to you. You might be watching me in 2000, 2200 or 2300 and I might be in heaven. You see, the economy in heaven and the economy on earth is not the same. On earth, the inflation keeps increasing and it affects the prices of everything each day each night each second and each minute let us assume that you already have the land if you don't have the land buy the land from a village near a big city the big city would give you the market and the village will give you cheap labor and cheap land you must have a borehole. The borehole is going to help you a lot. The pottery drink a lot of water. You must have a structure. The structure, if you don't have the structure yet, build the structure with simplicity. You must have at least 35 to 40 feeders for 1,000 layers or for 1,000 rollers. At least you must have 18 to 20 drinkers for your 1,000 layers or for your 1,000 rollers. At least you must have rechargeable solar light or any rechargeable light or you must have a means of light. You are going to need it for the period of two weeks during the brooding stage. You are going to need tarpaulin or a big plastic tetrete bag, big plastic bag. You are going to use it to cover some part of the structure to maintain some level of the temperature. And also you must have shovel, at least one shovel. And also you must have wheelbarrow. If you don't know the price of wheelbarrow, go to any building material shop or any china shop near you. At least you must have sawdust. The sawdust you must, at least you must have sawdust. You must have at least 20 bags of charcoal, durable charcoal, hard one. At least 20 bags of charcoal if you are not going to use gas brooder or electricity brooder. The next on the list you must know for knowing the cost of raising 1,000 layers or 1,000 dollars is you must know the cost of a day OJ currently in your country. Find out from a good hatchery company. How much is a day OJ costing now? If one day OJ is costing $1 now, it means you are going to need $1,000 for your day old chicks plus extra dollars for transportation and one advice is that when you are buying your day old chick avoid buying cheap or but avoid buying from unqualified hatchery buy it from a reputable hatchery which has reputation of producing day old chicks for farmers because most of the success is going to depend on the foundation on which your day old chick was hatched so be careful of where you buy your day old chick from buy it from a repeatable company a repeatable hatchery now after knowing the price of a day old chick in your locality from a repeatable company let us shift our focus to another five important lists that you must know for raising thousand leads or thousand dollars i said important because this item that i'm about to mention is going to demand money from your pocket daily, weekly, and monthly. And this section can break you down, or it can collapse your business, or it can kick you out from the business, or it can make you run away from your goal, or it can make you run away to wherever you came from. So let's get along with this section. Now, after knowing the cost or the price of a day old chick in your locality from your reputable company, let us shift our focus on five important aspects of the poultry farm business. The first on the list is, I, I said important because these items are going to demand money from your pocket daily, weekly, and monthly. And this is where most people run away from the business. So you must pay attention at this section very well the first on the list is you must know the approximate daily feed consumption by thousand layers or thousand rollers i've made i'm going to give you a brief of the approximate daily feed consumption 
of thousand layers or thousand brothers i've made a vivid video about it search it in one of my video the title of the video is approximate daily feed consumption by thousand layers or thousand brothers for you to feed your thousand layers from week one to week 21 you are going to need 10.6 tons of feed when you convert these tons into kilogram you are going to need 10,600 kilogram of feed to feed your thousand layers from week one to week 21 only one ton is thousand kilogram so you need thousand 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 ten thousand point six hundred ten thousand six hundred kilogram of feed to feed your thousand layers from week one to week two when we come to broilers you need about four thousand six hundred and twenty seven kilogram of feed to feed your broilers from week one to week six only let me repeat the broiler side again when we come to broiler side you need about four thousand six hundred and twenty seven kilogram of feed to feed thousand broilers from week one to week six only normally broilers the next thing on the item that I say it is very important is you must know the cost of current feed now. Are you going to prepare your own feed? It is very good idea. Are you going to buy your own feed? It is very easy, but it is not cheap. Mixing your own feed is not easy, but it is cheaper than buying already made feed so if you want to buy your own feed you must know the current price for starter mash grower mash and layer mash if you want to mix your own feed you must know the current price for a bag of maize maize is very important if maize is not in the market then it might collapse your idea of mixing your own feed you must know the current price of maize and you must know the current price of wheat bran soya bean concentrate and other i think the main ingredient that may cause you to dig deep into your pocket is the concentrate wheat bran soya bean and the maize maize is the main raw material for mixing your own feed so you have to target an area where maize is produced in abundantly and cheaply and you can source your maize from that place so it is very important know the approximate daily feed by layers by thousand layers and thousand dollars after that you must know the current feed price in the market if you want to know more about the vaccination schedule i've made video about it you can search in one of my videos Safubafo vaccination schedule for poultry I've made a video about it. And for the feed, if you want to know how to mix your own feed, I've made videos about it. Search it in one of my videos or poultry videos and you are going to get it. The next thing I would like you to consider is labor cost. Labor cost is going to demand money from your pocket. Whether you are making money or you are losing money, your employee is going to demand his or her salary from you. So you need to put all into consideration you need to factor in for you to know or predict the amount of money you need to raise thousand layers or thousand dollars all these items that i've listed make your calculation ask the price the current price of it and they make your cal calculation no mind you you might have the price today but you might start in the next three months in the next three months, the prices are going to change due to inflation or due to uh, maybe mismanagement of the economy. So you must factor in all. There's going to be miscellaneous expenditure along the way. There's going to be unexpected expenditure along the way. It is going to come. That is part of life. So you need to factor in all and all the items that I've mentioned. Do your calculation know the price of it and then do your calculation and trust you and trust me you are going to have at least the approximate cost of raising thousand or thousand layers or thousand dollars 
Thank you for watching Safuba Fools TV. If today is your first time of hearing this wonderful voice, kindly subscribe, like, and comment. Bye-bye.